Hey, welcome back to my channel, Cooking with Manual Focus, and today we're cooking some bang bang shrimp, and we're going to saute it. So first things first, man, we got that cast iron pan, and we got about two tablespoons of butter, and then we got our large shrimp there. That's about a pound's worth, and now what we're going to do is we're going to hit it with that Tony's Creole seasoning. So any Creole seasoning that you want to use, that is fine and dandy but you just want to get that creole seasoning in there and let that butter and that seasoning go to work so let me give you a little bit of tip on cooking with cast iron so you want to bring your temperature up slowly with that cast iron because you don't want to risk cracking your cast iron so any rapid changes of temperature you can definitely damage your cast iron pans so just make sure that you're bringing that heat um, up slowly so now you see we got that heat where we wanted a medium high heat and what we want to do is create a thin crust with that shrimp and you can see on the bottom what's going to end up forming in the bottom of that pan and some people say man you're burning the pan no that's what we call fun now we're starting to create again some flavor in the bottom of your pan and then you can use that flavor once you scrape that bottom you can use it for other things and other recipes like stock and all that good stuff so don't think that you you let anything go to waste man so hey that's what i'm here for man is to get you educated man but here we go man so you want to cook these shrimp man about one to two minutes on each side and again our goal really is to get a nice thin crust since we're not frying these shrimp we're sauteing them and once you do that man you can see that shrimp right there that i just turned has that crust that we're looking for so now we're ready to start taking these bad boys out and again you can see if you see why i'm taking those shrimp out look at that right there that's what we call fun in the cooking world so f-o-n-d fun and you can look look that up man so that's where that flavor is right there, man. So you can see it, man. And like I said, if you want to make some gravy or something like that, that is the perfect time to make some gravy because now you just got a bunch of flavor in the bottom of that pan, man. You can scrape that up and then make something fantastic, man. Something magical. That's where the magic happens. All right, so let's go ahead and get ready for the sauce. So here is the sauce. So you need a half a cup of mayo, right? So what we're creating is another bang. So you gotta have that bang with the shrimp and then you gotta have that bang with the sauce. Now we got a, four, a fourth of a cup of chili sauce, that sweet chili sauce, and then a fourth of a cup of sriracha. And now you get two teaspoons of soy sauce and then you let your wrist go to work, man, and mix these ingredients up. And then now you got that bang, bang. So you got that one ingredient with the shrimp, bang. And then you got that other ingredient with the sauce, bang. So now you got that bang, bang shrimp. Now you're bringing that shrimp into that sauce right there. Hey, RIP that shrimp that just fell out man it passed that five second rule so we ain't gonna use that man but dunk that shrimp in there man get that thing nice and coated and after that man it's just with presentation you're taking that out and here's a nice easy appetizer man that you can make for your guests or even for yourself whenever you want to make it man got you back in the game and here's an alternative to the fried bang bang shrimp so Man, I appreciate you guys, man. And there it is right there. Bang, bang, shrimp sauteed style. And we'll see you guys later, man. Peace.